Friday night's probably my favorite night of the week. You know why? Oh yeah, it's time for chicken wings. Good thing we got this super powerful, awesome Toyota Highlander to get the sled home and get her all delivered to Nigel. Wow, this thing's got way too much power. Man, if you want to see something eat fuel, drive a little freaking Highlander V6 with a trailer. That took me like half a tank of fuel to drive like an hour. But ah, I was in a headwind too, and you know what? With uh, one or even two sleds on it, this thing pulls that little trailer back there pretty well. Well, all the guys in the diesels are laughing at me. Hello! Into a pass. Let's see if we got enough power. Let's go already! I'm actually allowed to haul something like 3,500 pounds with this thing, which is way more than I'd ever put on it. I'm in the market for another truck. Uh, I didn't really use the Duramax that much. Like, as a 2,500 truck, I, I barely ever used it for towing big loads like more than once or twice so I ended up getting rid of it and just switching to this thing just to get me through the winter and for the past maybe month or so I think one weekend maybe I got to actually go to dealerships and have a look at trucks but I've just been so freaking busy with work and YouTube and sledding and too busy having fun to go look at trucks so I do plan on getting out here hopefully within a week or two and buying probably something, if not brand new, newer. I am a GM guy, so uh, you can let me let me have it. Let me uh, let me have all your criticism about that too. Articat and GMC. Oh, my plan today with the truck, and I say today because it seems to be something that's pretty much changing on a daily basis. Uh, I wanted to get a flat deck at first. Now I'm not so sure about the flat deck. Um, so what I'm thinking I'm going to do is buy a half ton truck, fairly new, and put a single sled deck in it, actually build my own deck for it, and that way I can still throw stuff under it, um, into the box, still have some storage space down there, put my sled up top, and still be able to pull a trailer around. I used to have this uh, um, all-terrain, this 2014 all-terrain, and I, I'm still kicking myself for getting rid of that truck, I don't know why the hell I got rid of it. I should have kept it and never should have got the Duramax in the first place, but uh, whatever. Damn, I missed that truck. Yeah, Friday Night Wing Night, that's kind of weird, isn't it? We've got this uh, bar that is literally almost out in the middle of nowhere. One of our favorite bars, and you can tell it's, it's a local bar. There isn't a lot of people that go there besides locals, so when you walk in, you end up knowing absolutely everyone, and it's just like, hey, I went to school with like half the people in here. And in the summer, it turns into a biker bar. So uh, we'll definitely be hitting it up there. Um, well, Friday, night, Friday night's our favorite night to go out uh, to go get some chicken wings. So we'll be doing that on our bikes here soon if it stops freaking snowing. I know I was talking about the snow the other day there. And guess what's in store for all weekend is another, I don't know, maybe foot of snow. Nigel sent me a Snapchat this morning of him on the way to work, on the way out to his job site. He's got that Dodge with the 6 inch lift kit and 35 inch tires. And when he got out of the truck this morning, he sent me a Snapchat, and the door is scraping through the snow. So, as if we didn't already have enough snow in Alberta, it looks like there might have been just another 2 feet dumped uh, west of town here. Anyway, I headed home from work right now. Gotta go drop off this trailer and Nigel's sled at his place there. And then after that, I'll be picking up the gentleman for wing night. This is where we are tonight. Wing night at the Burberry Saloon. What did you get? What did I get? I got a picture, a picture of what? A picture of Red Label. <laughs> Johnny Walker. You gotta have a fun night tonight. Oh yeah. <laughs> How many chickens had to die Galenia. so that we could have a meal? Not enough. Not enough. Need more chickens. This guy right here. Ugh. All rebuilt. New newer clutch. I'm gonna stick it on. So um, I also gotta take apart the console because I have the tennis switch unplugged, so I'll have to do that. We're gonna get the white M8 all buttoned up for Sunday and for next weekend. Always awesome going for wing night with the buds. We're gonna be doing some snowmobiling here on Sunday again. It has been snowing almost non-stop here. Uh, every time I think 
Like, I'd like to get on the bike. We're just sitting back there. The bike I haven't even ridden yet. It ends up snowing like another foot here. It's supposed to be snowing all night tonight, all day tomorrow, and all day Sunday. I haven't been going to Revelstoke as much this year because why go to Revelstoke when all the good snow is here? It's like, I'm not driving an extra five hours. Anyway, that's all I got for tonight. If you like this video, smash that subscribe button down below, and I'll see everybody in the next one. Mm -hmm.